Hello and welcome to Chapter 2 from Stevens' Introduction to Statistics, the Think and Do book. In this chapter, we will assume that we have collected our data through some sort of sampling method, and then what we want to do is describe the data. And, you know, humans are not very good at taking a giant list of numbers or values and, you know, making, making much sense out of it. So we have these various indices that we use to describe the data. And we start off with averages, and those should be familiar to you. That's the mean, median, and mode. But then we go one step further, and we try to describe how the data varies. And um, basically, we can do the variation with respect to um, the standard deviation, uh, something called the variance. And then we also have the range, which is just the largest minus the smallest. And then we get into describing relative standing of the various scores. And we'll do that in two different ways. First we will describe a position with respect to standard deviations, which comes from our variation chapter. And then we'll also describe a position in terms of its percentile or quartile. In which case in that chapter we'll also discuss box plots. And then we'll get into weighted averages, which you see quite a bit, and um, a problem that arises quite often called Simpson's Paradox. So it's a fairly long chapter, but it's pretty straightforward, and I hope you like it. So the next video will start with chapter 2.1, Averages. See you later.